Okay, so before we start, if you are new on my channel or if you did not subscribe my channel, just go to my channel and click on subscribe. Make sure that click on this bell button and check mark this send me all notification for this channel and click on save. By doing this, you will get every single update of my new videos. Also visit my channel, I am sure that you will find a lot more cool stuff on my channel. Welcome back everyone, my name is Adnan Chaudhary from Taste Tutorials and let's start our work. First of all, we will create any document. The size of the document is 1400 pixels by uh, 1800 pixels and background contents I will keep transparent and we will click on create. Now the new document is created, now we will import our file which is used for our background. This is a moon image and uh, for this image uh, we will just resize this. a new layer and uh, we will select a rectangular oops, sorry it's a, uh, a circle tool and then we will create a circle right on the moon to give it a shine so let's do it now we will adjust the size uh, according to the moon size We'll move to the blending options and we'll apply some inner glow and after glow. The settings are Now we will create a little snow for this we will use some noise and some blur and then we will apply some levels so let's do it.
as you can see that the noise is created very nicely and now on the next step we will uh, import the we can say that floor and uh, for this you can see that we will use a background and uh, for this background we will resize this and make it uh, look like same as the background so let's do it Now you can see that this work is done very nicely and now we will keep uh, pick our character as I already cropped that from background and we will just drag it on our main document and we will resize this and give this some adjustments. On this step what we will do is we want to apply the background shine on our character so the moon shine will be visible on our character so we will create a uh, control plus a then we'll inverse the image and uh, sorry inverse selection and then we will simply just uh, give this uh, shine a layer mask of our character and that's the thing which we will do so let's do it On this step what we'll do is uh, we will separate the snow and we'll uh, make it uh, foreground for our character so it will be visible on our character and we will lower the opacity to make it look like much better. On this step, we are going to apply uh, dodge and burning. Uh, first of all, uh, we will give some shine to our character to make it look like same as the situation looks. So we will do some dodge and burning.
now we'll apply some extra elements to make our uh, image more interesting and attractive so we'll do some birds image and uh, we'll uh, do some adjustments let's do it Now we will apply a lens flare to give a natural light leak to our shine. And now in final steps uh, we will make our image more soft and dreamy so for this we will apply a filter which is called oil paint filter so we'll apply some filter and some color adjustments to make our image uh, look much better in final output.
the final steps, what we will do is we will simply just apply a camera raw filter to make our image uh, much more adjusted and more attractive. Okay, so these are the last steps. What we will do is we will make it a little uh, dreamy look. So for this we will apply a filter and high pass. For this let's do it. We have done our work i hope you like this video uh, if you like this video make sure to give this video a thumbs up we will meet in our next video never stop and keep learning